Matthew. Also, I guess to follow up on Burundi, uh, it'd been said, yesterday you'd said you know, you're waiting for an assessment from MENUB. So I'm wondering, and, and I think that you're going to find that there are other people wondering of this statement of on what basis is, did the Secretary General uh, take note of the broadly peaceful nature of the election? Just media reports? Was there a communication to him from MENUB? Has he heard from the Office of the, of the Human Rights? And, and what about what level of death would, would, would cause an election to not be seen as peaceful by the Secretary General? Well, I, you know, I'm not going to dissect every word in, in this statement. Um, what I want to remind you of is the uh, clearly stated concerns that the uh, Secretary General expressed before uh, the elections and the fact that he highlighted the fragility and uh, the potential, uh, um, the potential, um, a possibility of uh, of a lot of violence uh, in the country. So uh, right now in the statement, he took note, again, of a broadly peaceful conduct of the election. This is not about the result of the election. And uh, more importantly, he's also stressing uh, the importance uh, for all Burundians to, um, to engage in an inclusive, dialogue, political dialogue, also stressing the responsibility of the Burundian authorities to uh, protect civilian population and for everyone to remain calm, not engage in further acts of violence, and also for the necessity to be accountable for any violation of human rights. But I guess my, just, uh, just to be, because there are many people, even in response to the statement that he made, have come out today and said that there were people that were either you know, afraid to be seen not to vote, afraid or, 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 or vice versa. There was the, the marking of fingers that's on the UN News Center story on this is not it's quite as positive as, as it's portrayed there. And so uh, people, I guess people are seeing this as, as if it's called peaceful election, if people either don't vote it's broadly out of fear. peaceful. He right. took note of the broadly peaceful but based on what? conduct what I just of the election, based, based on from the, the reports we got on the ground. And I think, from whom? I'm th I think the, um, the, the, you know, the next step now, Matthew, is to wait for the, uh, the assessment uh, from Minub. And my recollection last time is that it, it was pretty quick. So right, let's just wait. wait for that. But let's he didn't just wait. wait. For I guess that. my point is he didn't wait. So I'm just asking if you can say what, like, what was this statement based on? Where is he? And what did he base the statement on? Do you see what I'm saying? I said, I said from reports from the ground, obviously we have a, a presence on the ground and they can make a f very uh, large kind of broad appreciation of the level of uh, uh, or not of violence. Nizar, do you want to ask? A